dementia. It's in the very early stages, but, but yes, there's a toxic buildup of protein in your brain. It's not something to worry about immediately. This is a very slow process. We're currently running medical trials, but at present there is no cure. We have no way of knowing the degenerative effects that this can have on your brain. So, am I going to forget things? What's that going to be like? Yes, you might start to forget some things, but understand that that's completely normal. You don't seem to be showing any signs at the moment, so it will be a long time before you do. Um, revising, I mean, it's just so difficult, but there's so much to learn, and it's just it's complicated, and you get them mixed up, mm -hmm. like, like a 10 or an abase or so, it just it gets all confusing after a while. You didn't run out of time, though, did you? No, I had like five minutes spare, which was good. I was just hoping I was putting down the right answers. <laughs> <laughs> and how did your practical piece go? Yeah, that was okay as well. I mean, I was a bit nervous, so I kept making mistakes because the examiner was sitting down beside me with like a camera recording, so I just kept messing up. Chris, how was work today? Chris, you haven't said a word. <laughs> Uh, it was good, yeah, the same old. So Kira, how was school? It was okay, like nothing much. And my family, what about them? Well, there are plenty of care options available for both them and yourself. I've got a pamphlet here. I mean, will I forget them? Am I going to forget my family? There is a very real chance that you may start to forget them, yes. Yeah, it's just a bunch of our school friends, because... Um, Is it a mixed bunch? Yeah, it's a mixed bunch, because we've all finished our exams, so we thought we'll take a break. <laughs> and where about are you going to stay? We're going to stay in Malia. Oh, that'd be good. Yeah. Oh, sounds fun. And then, I don't know, maybe in the future, other places, hopefully that'll be fun. Yeah, what, you getting an apartment, or what? Um, not sure, I think. Hey, I'm sorry about earlier. I was just about out of it. My mind was elsewhere. Oh, it's all right. You've probably had a long day at work. Yeah. Don't worry. I love you. I love you too. Tell them. Tell them! How are they going to cope? Tell them. Who's going to look after them? Tell them! Liz? Liz? What was it you wanted to tell me? Whatever it is, it's been bothering you since yesterday. You know I'm here for you. I wasn't at work yesterday. I was at the doctor's instead. I was getting results back of some tests I had done. Well, it turns out I've got some form of dementia. I mean, it's like bits of my brain rotting away. At least that's what it feels like. The doctor told me there's no cure. And soon, soon enough, I'm, going, I'm not going to be able to look after you or Kira anymore. But I'm going to forget. I'm going to forget all of this. And you 
news. Oh, isn't that kind of like dying? It wouldn't be me. It would be different. It wouldn't be me anymore, honey. And you kid are gonna... You're gonna have to watch me forget that you're my family. As you know, we've got something to tell you. I have Alzheimer's. It's a form of dementia. What does that mean? It means I'm going to start forgetting things. And when I do, well, I won't be able to look after you as well as I used to. I may even need help myself sometimes. How long? Until I start forgetting. I'm not really sure. You probably notice before I do. I can look after you. Me and Mum can look after you. Oh, sweetheart, it's such a burden that I don't want to put that on you. I'm so sorry this happened. It's not your fault, Dad. It's okay. We'll be okay. Shall we go now? Dad? Come on, let's go. So, do I know you? Yeah, my name is Kira. Come on, I'll take you home. 